Jeff from Off-Road Stuff. He's got a YouTube channel. We're going to take him for a ride up. We're having a good time out here at UTV Takeover 2021. Yes, sir. He works with an outfit called Freedom Ropes. they got some great gear. They've been sending me up those big, heavy recovery ropes I'm using on the 510 and the Nodwell. Take you along for the ride. All right, let's do it. You lost it. <laughs> That's gonna suck. What do you have to say for yourself? I just walked my Nodwell out of its track. And it's kind of a pain in the butt to put back on.
Country song. I travel all over the country. I seldom sleep in a bed. And when I get tired of walking, I simply stand on my beautiful morning glory. Kissed and caressed by the dew. Beautiful morning glory. Good morning glory to you. And today we're in the old Duramax. We've got Poppy the Poppy the Mini Blue Hiller with me today she's having a good old time but we're headed out to sand hollow you'd think i'd had enough of this place after the last couple weeks and two big events back to back but we love it out here once you get a little sand in between your toes you'll always come back or some sand in your crack whatever way you want to put it so we're out here today gonna take the old duramax and the flatbed trailer down and grab the nod well and do a little bit of maintenance on it we're going to actually cut the tensioner blocks off and move them a little bit so that we can uh, readjust that track so I don't walk out of them again. So we got it back on with no problem and got back to the shop for a few days here. It's uh, bearing down on the end of the week already on a Thursday. So we're having a good old time. Been busy at the shop, been busy on recoveries, and we've been busy on YouTube. We have probably I don't even know how many videos to edit, but we're going to keep cracking away on that and try to keep you up to date, and we'll take you along for the ride. to lose your perch all right it looks a little lonely out here today but we just got a couple more of these crossbars to put on really doesn't take too much to put this on just a little bit of patience so we'll get these all bolted on here and Like I still got some fine thread and some coarse thread bolts on these, but they'll be just fine. 
course over there. Girl, that a way to break my heart. That a boy, girl, that a way to tear me apart. You took me for all I had. I treated you too good and too bad. That a boy, girl, that a way to break my heart. Now I'm just a sad and lonely guy. And it's all because all you do is make me sad. I'm feeling blue. That a boy, girl, that a way to hurt my pride. That a boy, girl, you really tore me up inside. He took me for all I had. I treated you too good and too bad. And that a boy, girl. That a way to break my pride. Make me cry. That a boy, girl. And you took me for all I had. I treated you too good and too bad. That a boy, girl. That a way to break my heart. Make me cry. That a boy, girl. All right, there she is. So we got a four bar overlap. Keeps that together. I got the inside bolts I gotta do, but I can do them when I get back. Other than that, she's golden. sneak out here on the main road make sure everything's tied down tight again double check our chains and binders and we'll go
go over to the shop and do a little maintenance. And thanks for coming along for the ride. got a tank and everything on it so anytime we're out and about we need a little air we just back up here and punch a little to it so all right well we got a little bit of a flat here so anytime you got a rig you're using for lots of work or on and off the road make sure you got some sort of air in it but uh air food and water today i could probably live without the food but i need air and i need water so we're gonna uh get this aired up and get her back to the shop see what that thing's got in it maybe a screw or something but it's not a bad little setup 